Hey, what's up? Dale Douglas here. Hey, today I'm going to show you how to install a basic trailer winch. Um, as you can see, my old my old winch, pretty rough shape. Maybe you've maybe you've got one like this, or maybe you've been at the boat ramp and you've seen guys having a, a hard time loading because their winch is really bad. Mine recently snapped, and I had to tie it back. Um, so I want to show you how simple it is. Uh, to install a new one bought this for like $35 off of uh, off of Amazon this is a Reese uh, winch so for the sake of time I went ahead and uh, loosen these two bolts and this is all that holds this winch on so we're gonna take these off one and two And that's all it holds this thing on. Two bolts. Pretty simple. You can see this one's rusted. This latch, as you're going down the road, would, would come undone. Uh, probably not the, the most uh, stable and secure thing. So, we are going to install a new one. This is very, very simple. This one is, is more heavy duty than what, what I had on there previously. So, line up the holes. This one has uh, a few different hole patterns. Um, Alright, this thing takes a 9 16 In my case, your boat may have a, but it's a uh, 9 16 So, wrench and socket. You just tighten her down. Right, you can go to the, to the back one, same thing. Down your here, you can get to it. All right, so we've got it secured. Now, we're going to take that off. We're going to have to, ooh, we're prepared for that. That is not the right size. All right, so once we get this mounted, the next thing we've got to do We've got to install a handle. So it's got two flat sides. Just line those up on there. Slide it down on. And then you've got a lock nut that's going to go on there. Like that. And we're going to tighten it up.
this would probably have worked a lot better with like a uh, a ratchet in the socket unfortunately I didn't have one this size so I'm making this work so once you get your handle installed we're gonna simply slide our hook through give it a little slack to our boat, flip the lever over. Tighten it down. You may have to find a different, shorter handle for my boat because that hits my the nose of my boat whenever. That's it. It's that simple. Two bolts, install the handle, hook it to your trailer, winch it tight, make sure you, you flip the lever over, and you're done. So that's the first uh, of many upgrades that I told you I'd be doing on my ProCraft. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click like, subscribe below, and we'll see you next time.